This is a video about a bunch of people who get together for one reason, to save dogs. The Little Red Dog was started by my mom, PJ, and my dad, Steve. Say hi, guys. Hi, hi guys. And I'm their daughter, Mackenzie, and I'm the development director here at TLRD. We are backed by an army of super generous fosters and volunteers, and together, we are on a mission from dog. What do we do? We save dogs from high kill shelters and off the streets and place them in loving forever homes. The reason I started the Little Red Dog is because I was volunteering at a couple of local rescues and I kept seeing dogs that had been adopted and end up back in the shelter. In 2020, California shelters killed over 39,000 dogs. Texas killed over 52,000. Hey Carlo, is there anything wrong with these dogs? Absolutely not, Mackenzie. They were always let down by the humans and it's not their fault. Together with our awesome team of volunteers, fosters, and supporters, we save about 500 dogs a year. Since we started in 2011, we've saved over 4,000 dogs! Yay! But it's not all rainbows and butterflies. We at the Little Red Dog get down to business with the TLRD difference. At TLRD, the dog is our client not the human. That mindset is hard for some humans to digest, but our return rates stay low when we put the dog first. Right, Dad? That's right, Mook. The TLRD difference is that we focus first and foremost on the dog's behavioral needs. We ensure the lifestyle and experience of the human matches that of the dog. We also focus on behavior training for the human. The number one reason why dogs get returned to rescues is because dog behavior isn't taught by the rescue but not with us. Did you know that all dogs are 98% gray wolf? Actually, Mook, they're 98.6% gray wolf, which is exactly why dogs need a strong pack leader. And a strong pack leader starts with the right behavior training. TLRD even has an on-call dog behavior specialist. Meet Gary. When dogs have a calm and confident leader, they feel more confident because they have a pack leader who speaks their language and can show them how they expect them to act. Having trainers like Gary on our team who specialize in dog behavior helps keep dogs out of the shelters. But saving lives isn't free. On average, it costs about $700 to save one healthy dog. That's enough money to save a whole dog. We make sure every dog that comes into our program is spayed or neutered, microchipped, and vaccinated at minimum. If they need more care, we take care of that too. We save dogs of all ages, all sizes, all breeds, and we don't discriminate. Not only that, we're the only rescue that hosts virtual adoption events twice a month. We have a film crew come out, we ask our fosters to bring pups, and we stream live shows. If you're interested, please go to our website, thelittlereddog.org, <laughs> and we will be right back with another dog. Our name, The Little Red Dog, is actually a reminder of why we do what we do. It's a tribute to The Little Red Dog that Michael Vick beat to death because she didn't want to fight. No dog deserves that kind of life. We have an amazing team of people who are all motivated to continue saving lives and making a real difference in the lives of animals and the humans alike. TLRD is clearly a dog's best friend, but we can't do it alone. The demand for fosters, donations, and support is needed now more than ever. With your support, we can continue saving lives and making the world a better place, one dog at a time. Oh, and we save cats too.